Hi, this is Kayla with Baker Electric Home Energy, and welcome back to part two of setting up your LG Interview 2 monitoring system. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use your LG Interview 2 monitoring system now that it's been set up. If you've not already set up your Interbox connection with the SD Genie account, please refer back to LG setup video you can find on bakerhomeenergy.com slash orientation. Now that that's been set up, let's move over to the app where you can get familiar with all the amazing features LG Interview 2 provides. Although there are slight variations to the layout for your desktop and mobile, you will find the structure of the app to be the same. On the left-hand side of your screen, the hamburger menu displays three top-level menu items. Your system, usually labeled by your name, account, and support. Your system has three sub-menus, dashboard, monitoring, and system info. The dashboard is the default landing page displayed when the web page or app first loads. Here, you can see current weather conditions, your energy overview, and a general overview of your system. Under energy overview, you have the option to choose to display the energy production and consumption from the grid for either today or this month. Recent energy flow shows the volume of electricity generated during the past 15 minutes. The weekly energy graph at the center of your screen shows the volume of electricity produced and consumed over the last week. Here, you can also change the time period in one week increments. The trip to America graphic at the bottom of the screen shows the distance an electric car could travel powered by the electricity generated by your system. Clicking on the monitoring menu gives you more detailed information with the option to select the display in array or graph format. For each tab, you can further modify the information shown by choosing a custom date range, production for today, the past seven days, month, year, or lifetime. The array tab gives you a visual production of each panel associated with each array in your system. The darker the color of the panel, the lower its production. At the bottom, be sure to note the system production and the peak power of the module. The system production shows you the generation of electricity of your entire system of the time period selected. The graph tab gives you a more overhead view of the entire system's production and consumption. Depending on the time scale selected, use the scale bar below to adjust more specifically what the graph will show. The system info tab gives you more detailed information regarding your solar system. On the right, you can see the power generated by your system, which is updated every 15 minutes. Your inner box 2 status is displayed below. You will also see the connection to your smart meter. The report card gives you the option to download electricity generation data in 15 minute increments. Choose a date range and the file format in which you would like to receive your report. When making a report, we recommend a PDF or Excel file. The Notification Preference section allows you to select either Internet Disconnection or Check System Status Events to be sent to the email address that's associated with your LG interview account. Be sure to verify that these notifications are not being sent to your spam or junk email inboxes. The Monitoring Member Card allows you to grant monitoring access to another person. Should you need to, the button at the bottom of the screen is for home ownership changes in case the house is sold or you move. The account menu item is where you can verify your personal information is correct. Lastly, the support menu item gives you answers to frequently asked questions and a copy of your terms of use and LG's privacy policy. Finally, the contact menu item is where you can find how to reach out to Baker Electric Home Energy or the team at LG. Should you have any further questions, go to bakerhomeenergy.com or call our service department at 760-546-6099 and speak with an expert representative.